very easily. Like after a team fight, if Nigma take it on VP side of the map and bait out a key spell, yeah. they can just go again, right? Like they're not locked in. They are locked into zero cooldowns on the, on the fog. Sure it works like that. Obviously. Uh, save self LSA, but still pulled back from Kuro. No, I mean, they actually do anything here. Don't have an orb of venom, but is still ooh, good, another good LSA. Another blink of dagger. Very fire. Very fire. Chase, run away. Another LSA. Punch down. Save. And a drop. First blood. Kuro. Oh, no. I got the first blood. Yeah. I mean, always very good on the Rubik, right? I mean, how many teams have even played position five Rubik in the past months? It's like basically just like. See mind control. Again, it's, it's not an easy kill setup. They're so freaking tanky. And the Radiant Ward C save, and that's what they're pinging. They're just like, yo, know, like, there's no Lena here, guys. Like, keep being aggressive. All right. Frostbite afterwards. EMP going to not really land. Only hits on the mind control. was still, like, incredibly fine at this point. Oh, the jump in on the top side, though. They try and catch him. Oh, Storm, no. But they're going to drop down the will o -Wisp. He dies. Oh, that was not how that was supposed to go. And the chase down now as they catch both of them with the Chrono. The follow-up is going to be there from the rest of VP as they just get eviscerated. My control chase down in the mid lane. Another tornado. What about as bad as it could have gone? At least they get the tower, but holy moly. Up on the high ground, but the rest of Nick was oh, coming, coming in. He wants that in power. Where's Wait. That oh, they just dropped a sentry though. He's in range. They see him. Okay. Jump forward. Good stun. Mind control with the quick fingers. And then afterwards, they're going to drop the Will O Wisp. Need to find their way out of here. Pull back in onto one. We hot down to very low mana. The Pearl's stun waiting pulls for the back in again. Yeah, he, he can't throw it. He's still worried. Now they just get the freezing field instead. Hey. Okay. Pearl's holding their ultimate hostage. Left it, kid. Still punching away at that tier two. He's not in the front forefront of this one. Miracle under control, RP, who canceled. No, he didn't use it. He ends up stealing the other one. Miracle is gonna be brought down and with the RP still available, they're gonna chase down Weeha and get that catch. Kuro though, going with the freezing field, trying to bring them all down, he takes down too. Weeha still chase, but with the BKB already popped, they have to be a little bit careful. I control throws out another stun, will get taken down by save. Oh my God, you know, have a, they a been state, waiting I suppose. Oh, no. this whole time? No, no, DK's here, this is the turnaround. He got his silence off. Rick, that might be enough to save it. him. The turn. Oh my god, you're right. They're able to make it happen. Weeha. Will he die though? Oh my god, GPK got him in the disarm. And now the walk away. He doesn't have Ghost Walk for another little bit. He's in a little bit of trouble, but Left Electric Kid is here now as well. GPK trying to live. The Will O Wisp knocks in the connect. The stun is there, but he gets healed back up. The mech is there from the bag. And Kuro just doesn't have strong enough right click. Let's finally bring him down with that Dragon Slave as Kuro goes oh, Kuro, for the though. jump away, gets gashed in the face so there is a little bit of a trade-off you know I, I almost wonder if you're like okay we'll take that. for mag to kill kuro and now in the late game it's like saving that chronosphere for miracle when they need it. A save gonna get jumped on but the turnaround immediately comes out at least is there with the xa we damage kuro tries to save the day but it's not gonna be good enough they took down both cores already chased down for more as they are gonna beat the crap out of my control and take his life as well now also has backtracked because that seems fair. Jump in, oh, Chrono nice. catches on to three. Epileptic gets stolen, Chrono. Is it gonna matter though? They don't have the damage there for the follow-up. Unbelievable performance here from Virtus Pro as they're gonna take another set of racks and surely more at this point with three dead for so long, no buybacks. They are looking to close this one out. It's just uh. A clean game of execution, really putting on a clinic right now from Virtus Pro. And they look like the dominant team that you're expecting to just like, you know, outclass their opponents. One more jump in, trying to bring down DM. If they can hold off, RP's gonna be used though. They can't take him down. They're gonna kill the storm. Everybody dead. Virtus Pro undeniable. I mean, they were on a bit of a, uh, a knife's edge with this lineup with like the reliance on these initiations from the DK and the Storm. And of course they wanted to snowball the game a little bit, but you can see how they, they had low cooldowns. Like you can understand what the game plan was. Like if they can dodge and, and force good fights and good pickoffs of their hero. You have to empower, because let's say Nygma, they go for like a Terror Bait or something, right? Oh, they go for a Zeus. Wow. This is just... Right.
I don't see how they abuse that. All right, we're just brawling. All right, All we'll right, get to that get later. Get in there. Get in there. Safe's dead. <laughs> for Sludgy H. And everybody runs away. All right, go ahead. Keep on talking. Yeah, I think it's over now. Into, you know. uh, <laughs> yeah. And also, there's no scaling on the side of Nigma, so... I don't even, like, Battle Fury, you might need to beat some hero scalings and stuff, Ooh. but I don't think it's a concern in this game. Warm battle as they kill off that tombstone. Light Strike Ray gonna connect. Save, getting gone on now. Tries to bring down Kuro. It is gonna throw out another Dragon Slave. Pull back in a little bit closer. The RP going to be used, but they have that Sun Ray to heal everybody up. Kuro wants a little of that action. <laughs> and if oh. I kill him. Oh my God. Is he in trouble? They went for Miracle instead. And they jump in with that Bluffy Kid and kill off GH. Okay. Uh, very weird battle there in the mid lane. We have though. We'll get some before he can palm out the skewer, but that just means he still has it. Sets up for the skewer underneath the tower. They do manage to find the kill though. So Miracle securing that one. As they trade off both of those heroes, an epileptic kid trying to chase down Miracle. Now in a lot of trouble. Kuro does not have anything left here to save him. Now the Maledict on the mind control can't quite connect on that LSA. Oh my oh, god, he's got he the tree the as well. He's yes. got the item. He needs this. It's over. All right, save. In the meantime, another LSA. Sick charges. Decided to pop. Oh, that was the timber. So I, I guess much more of like an active split pushing type of uh, build, I guess it feels like. The best thing about the blink is that it should help with this positioning for the static field because they need as much damage they can get in these engagements. Without a real scale and carry, that's like the best thing they're going to have going for them. LSA connects. In trouble. Laguna Blade afterwards just eviscerated. As Kuro wants to chase down and kill Ilias here, you can't has even the heal going the whole time. Light Strike, are you going to land afterwards? We have forced to use the Dissimilate. Kuro's still backing out of there. The egg is going to be popped. And, well, they get the stun off. DM, as they want to chase down Weeha. Another connection just barely on left, the edge. And Lexi oh. was chasing Kuro that whole time and just killed him. And then they blink forward and take down another kill. Damn. And you know you're going to be fighting in the river. So he maxes out the Guardian Sprint. You cannot contest a slider Dude. in a case like this. Dude. Another yeah, one. Get him out of here. Dude, another one. They keep hitting him. He just keeps getting him. That was nuts. This miracle is going to be chased down. This guy doesn't have a way out of here. The heals are trying to come out, but it's not going to happen. Weeha trying to bring down save. Can they even kill him? No. They're not going to be able to. He went for the in and out. He still has one more charge left. And that's like the classic desperation. The only way back in this game is kill bounties. I don't so. know. I I I feel like this. The it, Virtus Pro is just playing on another level right now. Like they are playing ridiculously good Dota, and a lot of it behind this Lena is. Well, they're gonna just solo RP there. Don't quite manage to get the catch onto mind control, but he will be found. He will be punished. Um, not dying and they're doing that that is i mean they're, they're stabilizing at a 12k deficit that's uh, kind of okay for now if they can uh perhaps Kuro? get something out of crow's death here but uh, crow's ready for the smoke pop crow's in there they're ready Save. Death. he's still doing all right this is good this is pretty good for nigma vp do they decide to back out now they're gonna buy back oh, that's a good one. so they want to go to try and take this okay while witch doctor ulti gonna be popped for this one and with that buyback, are they getting a little bit too fanciful here by V? The way to do it, maybe? Well, I mean, they have, like, dive and egg, and but I guess, you know, MC is probably the most survival. True. Over the multi-plate mail strat. We'll see how it works out. That's a big old clump of EP heroes. Oh Jumps my into God. the smoke. Oh, no. Yep, that's a bad one. That's a bad one. Oh, man. They put the, the new batteries and the smoke detectors on that one. That was instantaneous. Hello? Are you planning an aggressive maneuver? Safety first. Uh, jeez. Uh, uh, that's a fat finger. Oh, no. <laughs> guys. Oh, no. Phoenix is missing. Yeah, we saw it, guys. <laughs> oh, no. Miracle gonna be caught. Gonna be killed. Jesus. That's like the worst one to have happen, too. There's like, they know. They definitely know what happened. Oh, Guys, wow. why is it so bright out? <laughs> okay, well, they don't take the tier three tower, but it doesn't look like VP Carol that much. Yeah, GBK jumps forward, gets the pullback behind the tower, find the bash onto Kuro and find that final touch for the kill. An epileptic kid has enraged back up again with overpower. They kill him off. Virtus Pro just absolutely smashing Enigma here. They look so freaking good. 
They really do. Just super solid decision making. I, I look back to where when they just didn't fight that tier one mid versus the timber. And I think that just speaks a lot of this game. Where much like last game, BP identified exactly what Nigma needed because they had such a narrow window that uh, was required for victory. And both times now, they just look at it and say, like, yeah, we're just not going to give you that very specific thing you need. And we're kind of good. Oh, nice Yules, though. Oh, well played. Still has that Abyssal Blade afterwards. As well as BKB if they need it. Taunted. Lepid again pops the BKB. Kills off that egg. They're going to kill Kuro. Buys back on Kuro. Miracle just trying to run out of the base at this point. We'll have Thunder God's Wrath back up again in a second. There's a DD down here bottom side if they want to go pick that one up for the second round of this but they're in never mind they find miracle trying to keep alive good soul rip the stun it bounces onto miracle of all heroes and now the tombstone's gonna go down virtus pro just they can't stop them Twenty-eight thousand gold lead at 30 minutes but more importantly buildings falling game likely to be called soon as there is just no answer at all Chase down one by one by one. And uh, yeah, they, they don't have an answer. I mean, I agree with this. I would keep up the all chat and the waving until they GG too. I'd be like, guys, come on, seriously. There's a high five from MC. Yeah. These guys are being pretty jovial in the, the lobby as well. So no no BM here, folks. True, true. Now pulls back onto one, Bash is there. Silver Edge afterwards, Abyssal Blade. Yules keeps him alive for a moment, but only a moment as they will find that final kill onto Timbersaw. And GG is called Virtus Pro, an emphatic 2-0. Yeah, that was uh, pretty crushing. Kind of night and day compared to the last series uh, that I got to see from Nygma like, versus Alliance. They just looked like so in command during that. Then to see that happen, it's just like, whoa. All right, what, what happened there, guys? Yeah. And I mean, to anybody that I, I don't think there are many people.